solve by completing the square. Since a is 2, we're going to divide all terms by 2 so that we have a equals 1. So z squared minus 7 halves z minus 2 equals 0. Now we move the constant term on the right hand side, so we have z squared minus 7 half z equals 2. Then we take a half of b, which is negative 7 half divided by 2, which is negative 7 fourth, and then we're going to square the negative 7 fourth that is 49 over 16. That's the number we're adding on both sides. The negative 7 over 4 is really critical since we are going to use the number later on when we're completing the square. So we have z squared minus 7 halves z plus 49 over 16 equals 2 plus 49 over 16. To complete the square, basically you can factor a trinomial, but since we have fractions, it will be a little bit tricky. So, to make our factoring easier, you just have to copy down the half of b we just found, which is negative 7 over 4, inside the parentheses, and we square it, and that will be the answer equals 2 plus 49 over 6, 10, so it will be 32 over 16 plus 49 over 16. So that will give us 81 over 16. So then, by taking square root on both sides, we have z minus 7 over 4 equals plus minus radical 81 over 16, which is z minus 7 over 4 equals plus minus 9 over 4. So we have z equals 7 fourth plus 9 fourth. So we have two answers. One is 7 fourth plus 9 fourth, which is 16 over 4, which is 4. The other one will be 7 fourth minus 9 over 4, which is negative 2 over 4, so the answer is negative a half.